Section 49 of English Synonyms and Antonyms. This is a LibriVox recording. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. For more information or to volunteer, please visit LibriVox.org. Recording by James O'Connor. English Synonyms and Antonyms by James Champlin Fernald. Polite to Predestination. Polite. Synonyms. Accomplished. Civil. Complacent. Courteous. Courtly. Cultivated. Cultured. Elegant. Genteel. Gracious. Obliging. Polished. Urbane. Well-behaved. Well-bred. Well-mannered. A civil person observes such propriety of speech and manner as to avoid being rude. One who is polite, literally polished, observes more than the necessary proprieties, conforming to all that is graceful, becoming, and thoughtful in the intercourse of refined society. A man may be civil with no consideration for others, simply because self-respect forbids him to be rude. But one who is polite has at least some care for the opinions of others, and if polite in the highest and truest sense, which is coming to be the prevailing one, he cares for the comfort and happiness of others in the smallest matters. Civil is a colder and more distant word than polite. Courteous is fuller and richer, dealing often with greater matters, and is used only in the good sense. Courtly suggests that which befits a royal court, and is used of external grace and stateliness without reference to the prompting feeling, as the courtly manners of the ambassador. Genteel refers to an external elegance which may be showy and superficial, and the word is thus inferior to polite or courteous. Urbane refers to a politeness that is genial and successful in giving others a sense of ease and cheer. Polished refers to external elegancies of speech and manner without reference to spirit or purpose, as a polished gentleman or a polished scoundrel. Cultured refers to a real and high development of mind and soul, of which the external manifestation is the smallest part. Complacent denotes a disposition to please or favor beyond what politeness would necessarily require. Antonyms Awkward, bluff, blunt, boorish, brusque, clownish, coarse, discourteous, ill-behaved, ill-bred, ill-mannered, impertinent, impolite, impudent, insolent, insulting, raw, rude, rustic, uncivil, uncouth, unmannerly, unpolished, untaught, untutored. Polity, synonyms, constitution, policy, form or system of government. Polity is the permanent system of government of a state, a church or a society policy is the method of management with reference to the attainment of certain ends the national polity of the united states is republican each administration has a policy of its own policy is often used as equivalent to expediency as many think honesty to be good policy Polity used in ecclesiastical use serves a valuable purpose in distinguishing that which relates to administration and government from that which relates to faith and doctrine. Two churches identical in faith may differ in polity, or those agreeing in polity may differ in faith. Compare to law. Portion. Synonyms. Lot. Parcel. Part proportion, share. 
when any whole is divided into parts any part that is allotted to some person thing subject or purpose is called a portion though the division may be by no fixed rule or relation a father may divide his estate by will among his children so as to make their several portions great or small according to his arbitrary and unreasonable caprice when we speak of a part as a proportion we think of the whole as divided according to some rule or scale so that the different parts bear a contemplated and intended relation or ratio to one another thus the portion allotted to a child by will may not be a fair proportion of the estate proportion is often used where part or portion would be more appropriate compared to part poverty synonyms beggary destitution distress indigence mendicancy need pauperism penury privation want Poverty denotes strictly lack of property or adequate means of support, but in common use is a relative term denoting any condition below that of easy, comfortable living. Privation denotes a condition of painful lack of what is useful or desirable, though not to the extent of absolute distress. Indigence is lack of ordinary means of subsistence. Destitution is lack of the comforts and in part even of the necessaries of life. Penury is especially cramping poverty, possibly not so sharp as destitution, but continuous, while that may be temporary. Pauperism is such destitution as throws one upon organized public charity for support. Beggary and mendicancy denote poverty that appeals for indiscriminate private charity. Power, synonyms, ability, aptitude, capability, capacity, cleverness, cogency, competency, dexterity, efficacy, efficiency, energy, expertness, faculty, force, might, qualification readiness skill strength susceptibility talent power is the most general term of this group including every quality property or faculty by which any change effect or result is or may be produced as the power of the legislature to enact laws or of the executive to enforce them the power of an acid to corrode a metal the power of a polished surface to reflect light. Ability is nearly coextensive with power, but does not reach the positiveness and vigor that may be included in the meaning of power. Ability, often implying latent, as distinguished from active power. We speak of an exertion of power, but not of an exertion of ability. Power and ability include capacity, which is power to receive, but ability is often distinguished from capacity as power that may be manifested in doing, as capacity is in receiving. One may have great capacity for acquiring knowledge, and yet not possess ability to teach. Efficiency is active power to effect a definite result. The power that actually does as distinguished from that which may do. Competency is equal to the occasion, readiness prompt for the occasion. Faculty is an inherent quality of mind or body, talent some special mental ability. Dexterity and skill are readiness and facility in action having a special end. Talent is innate. Dexterity and skill are largely acquired. Our abilities include our natural capacity, faculties, and talents, with all the dexterity, skill, and readiness that can be acquired. Efficacy is the power to produce an intended effect as shown in the production of it.
as the efficacy of a drug. Efficiency is effectual agency. Competent power, efficiency, is applied in mechanics as denoting the ratio of the effect produced to the power expended in producing it. But this word is chiefly used of intelligent agents as denoting the quality that brings all one's power to bear promptly and to the best purpose on the thing to be done. Compare to address, dexterity, skillful. Antonyms Awkwardness, dullness, feebleness, helplessness, imbecility, impotence, inability, inaptitude, incapacity, incompetence, inefficiency, maladroitness, stupidity, unskillfulness, weakness. Praise. Synonyms. Acclaim. Acclamation. Adulation. Applause. Approbation. Approval. Cheering. Cheers. Compliment. Encomium. Eulogy. Flattery. Laudation. Panegyric. Plaudit. Sycophancy. Praise is the hearty approval of an individual or of a number or multitude considered individually and is expressed by spoken or written words. Applause the spontaneous outburst of many at once. Applause is expressed in any way by stamping of feet, clapping of hands, waving of handkerchiefs, etc., as well as by the voice. Acclamation is the spontaneous and hearty approval of many at once, and strictly by the voice alone. Thus one is chosen moderator by acclamation when he receives a unanimous, viva voce, vote. We could not say he was nominated by applause. Acclaim is the more poetic term for acclamation, commonly understood in a loftier sense, as a nation's acclaim. Plaudit is a shout of applause, and is commonly used in the plural, as the plaudits of a throng. Applause is also used in the general sense of praise. Approbation is a milder and more qualified word than praise. While praise is always uttered, approbation may be silent. Quote, approbation speaks of the thing or action. Praise is always personal. Unquote. From A. W. and J. C. Hare, Guesses at Truth, First Series, page 549, brackets M-A-C-M, apostrophe 66, closing brackets. Acceptance refers to an object or action. Approbation may refer to character or natural traits. Approval always supposes a testing or careful examination and frequently implies official sanction. Approbation may be upon a general view. The industry and intelligence of a clerk win his employer's approbation. His decision, in a special instance, receives his approval. Praise is always understood as genuine and sincere, unless the contrary is expressly stated. Compliment is a light form of praise that may or may not be sincere. Flattery is insincere and ordinarily fulsome praise. Antonyms Abuse, animadversion, blame, censure, condemnation, contempt, denunciation, disapprobation, disapproval, disparagement, hissing, ignominy, obloquy, reproach, reproof, repudiation, scorn, slander, vilification, vituperation. Pray. Synonyms. Ask, beg, beseech, bid, call upon, conjure, entreat, implore, importune, invoke, petition, plead, request, supplicate.
To pray in the religious sense is devoutly to address the Supreme Being with reverent petition for divine grace for any favor or blessing, and in the fullest sense with thanksgiving and praise for the divine goodness and mercy. The once common use of the word to express any earnest request, as, I pray you to come in, is now rare, unless in writings molded on older literature, or in certain phrases as, pray sit down. Even in these, please is more common. I beg you is also frequently used as expressing a polite humility of request. Beseech and entreat express great earnestness of petition. Implore and supplicate denote the utmost fervency and intensity. Supplicate implying also humility. Compare to ask, plead. Precarious. Synonyms, doubtful, dubious, equivocal, hazardous, insecure, perilous, risky, unassured, uncertain, unsettled, unstable, unsteady. Uncertain is applied to things that human knowledge cannot certainly determine, or that human power cannot certainly control. Precarious originally meant dependent on the will of another, and now, by extension of meaning, dependent on chance or hazard, with manifest unfavorable possibility verging towards probability, as one holds office by a precarious tenure, or land by a precarious title. The strong man's hold on life is uncertain. The invalid's is precarious. Antonyms Actual, assured, certain, firm, immutable, incontestable, infallible, real, settled, stable, steady, strong, sure, undeniable, undoubted, unquestionable. Precedent Synonyms Antecedent Authority Case, example, instance, obiter dictum, pattern, warrant. A precedent is an authoritative case, example, or instance. The communism of the early Christians in Jerusalem is a wonderful example or instance of Christian liberality, but not a precedent for the universal church through all time. Cases decided by irregular or unauthorized tribunals are not precedents for the regular administration of law. An obiter dictum is an opinion outside of the case in hand, which cannot be quoted as an authoritative precedent. Compare to cause, example. Predestination, synonyms, fate, foreknowledge, foreordination, necessity. Predestination is a previous determination or decision which in the divine action reaches on from eternity. Fate is heathen, an irresistible, irrational power determining all events with no manifest connection with reason or righteousness. Necessity is philosophical, a blind something in the nature of things, binding the slightest action or motion in the chain of inevitable, eternal sequence. Foreordination and predestination are Christian, denoting the rational and righteous order or decree of the supreme and all-wise God. Foreknowledge is simply God's antecedent knowledge of all events which some hold to be entirely separable from his foreordination, while others hold foreordination to be inseparably involved in foreknowledge. Antonyms Accident, chance, choice, free agency, freedom, free will, independence, uncertainty. Prepositions predestination of believers to eternal life. 
End of section 49. Recording by James O'Connor. Randolph, Massachusetts. December 2009.